And after rain took away all the softball action on Friday, the Hilltoppers were in full swing this afternoon for the annual Hilltopper Spring Fling. The Tops looking to bounce back at home after their midweek loss to Louisville, taking on the Dayton Flyers. We start in the top of the first of runners on first and second. A nicely placed ball to center field, and the Flyers are headed for home. But what a throw here by Briley Hayes as Randy Drennan gets the tag to keep Dayton off the board. And then the bottom of the second, Sophie Weber at the plate, and you knew as soon as this ball left the bat that this one was out of here. A solo bomb for the fifth-year senior to put the Tops on on the board and we get to the top of the third now two outs two on the Flyers looking to get on the board but TJ Wester has other plans what a snag here by the shortstop the Hilltoppers got it done in shutout fashion two to zero over Dayton and in game two, WKU took on Northern Illinois, and it was zeros across the board until the bottom of the fifth. Morgan Sharp lays the bunt down. Danielle Stewart gets caught up on what to do. She misses the throw at first, and that allows TJ Wester to score the first run of the game. The Tops continue to capitalize on the mistakes here. Kelsey Schmidt lays the bunt down as well, and Stewart with another error throw once again, and that allows everybody to advance, and Becca Campbell makes it home. And IU switches pitchers, and the errors still continue to roll back to back wild pitches allowed the Tots to gain a five to nothing lead and the Huskies could not respond enough as WKU will go on to win five to one. The Hilltoppers will be back in action starting tomorrow at 1230 for a rematch with Northern Illinois followed by a matchup with Southern Illinois.